na, na mfumo wa afya hapa nchini umeathirika vibaya kutokana na janga la virusi vya corona huku Wizara ya Afya ikiashiria kwamba zaidi ya wahudumu 1854 wa afya wameambukizwa kufikia sasa. Hadi sasa wahudumu 15 wa afya wameaga dunia kutokana na ugonjwa huo huku nchi hii ikinakili visa 426 vipya katika muda wa saa 24 zilizopita. Wizara hiyo sasa inaonya kwamba watu wa umri wa kati ya miaka 30 na 39 wanaeneza kunradhi virusi hivyo kwa haraka kama anavyo ripoti Purity Musel. Visa vya maambukizi ya virusi vya corona miongoni mwa wahudumu wa afya wanaoshughulikia wagonjwa wa COVID-19 vimeendelea kuongezeka. Kufikia sasa wahudumu 1854 wa afya wamedhibitishwa kuwa na virusi hivyo huku 15 wakiaga dunia. This puts the positivity rate for the healthcare workers at 2.9 which is fairly low compared to the global average of 10%. Of course one healthcare worker exposed is one too many. We will continue to work together with them to ensure that they have adequate PPEs ensure that we have done capacity building so that they know how to use the PPEs properly or practice infection prevention control measures and also not only at work but back in the community Wizara ya Afya leo iliripoti kwamba kiwango cha maambukizi nchini ni asilimia 7.9 hili likiwa ni ongezeko katika kiwango cha maambukizi ya virusi hivyo And if we were to look and extrapolate this 7.9% positivity rate it would mean right now in the country assuming a population of about 47 million it would mean that we have about 3 million cases again if we look at the change in positivity rate from the beginning of this uh, pandemic to where we are today it points out that the curve is not flattening kufikia sasa nchi hii imenakili jumla ya visa alfu thalathini na moja, mia nne, arubaini na moja vyo maambukizi ya virusi hivyo baada ya watu mia nne, shirini na sita zaidi kudhibitishwa kuwa na ugonjwa wa COVID-19 katika muda wa saa shini na nne zilizo pita. Nairobi leads with 132 cases, Kajado has 63, Kericho 48, Kiambu 24, Machakos 21, Migori 17, Mombasa 16, Kitui 13, Laikipia 13 both Nakuru and Kisumu have 11 cases Wasingishu has 10 Tarakanithi 8 Nyeri Busia 7 Makweni 6 Kilifi 4 Garissa 3 Nyandarua 3 Isiolo and Embu both have 2 cases whereas Meru Kirinyaga Kakamega Baringo and Lamu all have 1 case Vifo vitatu vya kiwango cha kijamii miongoni mwa vifo kumi vilivyoripotiwa katika muda wa saa 24 zilizopita na kufikisha 516 jumla ya idadi ya vifo hii ikiwa ni asilimia moja nukta sita ya kiwango cha vifo Wizara hiyo ilisema kuwa wagonjwa saba zaidi wamepona ugonjwa huo na kufikisha 1017869 jumla ya wale waliopona tangu mwezi Aprili miongoni mwa wale waliopona 195 walikuwa chini ya mpango wa utunzaji wa nyumbani huku wengine sitini na wawili wakiruhusiwa kuondoka kutoka vituo mbalimbali vya afya nchini Shirika la Afya Ulimwenguni WHO linasema kwamba nchi yoyote ambayo kiwango chake cha maambukizi ni chini ya asilimia tano hii ina maana kwamba maambukizi katika nchi hiyo yanazidi kupungua kiwango cha maambukizi ugonjwa huu hapa nchini ni asilimia saba nukta tisa. Hii kimaanisha kwamba maambukizi ugonjwa COVID-19 hapa nchini yanazidi kuongezeka. Purity Musio Darubini Nairobi